If you look at the Quran, chapter 6, verses 75 to 79, Abraham alayhi salam is having a conversation with polytheists who worship the sun, the moon, and a kawkab. Now, kawkab can either mean a planet or a star. And this is very interesting because this exact astral, astral triad is not mentioned in that specific way with one kawkab uh, in the Bible or the uh, previous dispensations. However, it is mentioned in primary source material. For instance, the stele of Nibonidus, which is so interesting because at the time the Babylonians were worshipping the sun, the moon and Venus. Who could have known that in the 7th century?